Hey y'all, it's Sarah again. Um, I have so many boxes going on. As I did in my last vlog that I was gonna be moving. And yeah, I've been working on this for a good while since my last vlog. Um, I did get accepted into the apartment. I got everything done except for next Tuesday. I am going to be moving um, I'm gonna be moving in next Tuesday, I believe, because it's my last week to be here. Since I gave my 30 day notice on the 1st of February of this month. So, next month I also turn 32. And I will have a brand new to me apartment. It's not brand new, but you know, it's enough. So, so far, I got my bathroom stuff, I got my kitchen stuff. I don't have everything in here just because, you know, I'm still using things, but I've been going through everything. You know, I've thrown a good bit out that I don't want to take because this apartment is really small, which is fine because it's just gonna be me and my cat. So now that I got some of the food packed up. So yeah, I like to do this because it's open and I don't want to go all over the place. So this is a great idea. Freezer bags. I recently got like a big quantity at Costco recently. So, and I got some spices and stuff that I don't want to get all over. I got some Cheerios cause I'm just putting like spices and my big thing of pancake mix I got from Costco that I haven't used. My syrup and my, my buttermilk pancake mix. That's the same in the Ziploc bag. I am taking that toolbox with me because, you know, I need a toolbox. And the rest that's in here, I don't quite remember what's in here, but these have been packed up for probably two weeks. Um, and then this is an empty box right now. I just went and got like eight more boxes y yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. So I still got like two empty boxes. Then I got this one packed up. That's got my glasses in it. So I'm going to have to like be very careful. But if I break all the glasses, I guess I could just buy more. <laughs> but I have coffee cups and stuff in there too. So I got cleaning stuff and my cat's cat toys in here. I've got Drano. I've got my paper towels, my magic erasers, um, some cleaning stuff. And um, this random box, actually, I need to mail. But I'm not going to do that yet, but I'm taking it with me. And yeah, it's just a bunch of random stuff. I'm still keeping my oven cleaner because I'm going to have an oven where I'm going. And I'm keeping the drain cleaner because I'm going to need drain cleaner just in case if I get a clog in the apartment. This is some clothing. Um, I'm not taping all these boxes yet that I'm still putting stuff in, of course. Um, but there's some dirty clothes in here. I don't want to do laundry until I get there because the laundry is way cheaper at this new apartment and they take coins, which I'm so ra glad of. Like, seriously, I do not like using the card laundry card here at my current apartment that I'm going to move out of. So yeah, there's a bunch of clothes in here. So this is going to be like my bedroom box. This is already like some kitchen stuff I've already um, packed up. So yeah, I've been doing a lot recently. Um, this, I don't know if I'm taking this with me or not. I'm still kind of debating. It's just a little shelf. I might take it just like maybe to put in my bathroom because I don't have like much room in there and much shelving, but I still haven't decided. And this file cabinet is probably going to go, um, uh, because I'm not going to have room for it and I don't need it. And I'm going to get a file cabinet that like has a handle on it and it's, it's just a smaller file cabinet that I can portably take with me. The desk I'm not taking because, oh, this is some extra water that was in the pantry, but um, I'm not taking this because I'm not going to have room for it and I don't use it. So the chair is going as well. Um, vacuum cleaner, of course, is going. So in here, this is the second bedroom. In here, the closet is totally empty because me and my caregiver have been um, cleaning as we go. So when we do the apartment that we don't um, have to come back and clean as much. Oh, this cord. 
this and vacuuming earlier because I've been making a mess. So that's the second bedroom progress. Um, oh no, you're not going in there. Sorry. So my bedroom is kind of in shambles as well. My whole apartment's in shambles, of course, because I'm moving. But I am going to be putting these hangers in the box. I kind of forgot about that. Um, and that's a really odd hanger the from a blanket I got yesterday. So yeah, I got all, I got my suitcase and there's some clothes right there and my Columbia jacket and just my regular laundry basket. I got a nightlight just cause I use that at nighttime when I sleep. Um, yeah, I got some weights that I might take with me. I'm not sure. I do want to like start lifting weights and like kind of have them like a home gym, but not really. So I'm not going to have room for this beauty. I don't think I will, unfortunately. So um, I am going to measure when I uh, move some stuff in on Tuesday. And if I can take it, I will. But if not, I'm probably just going to donate it. Um, because my bedroom closet is built in. So I'm not really going to need this. But I wish my TV would fit on this. Because I don't think I'm going to have my big TV in the living room because the living room is really small. So the air conditioner, so I'm actually selling one air conditioner because I only need one because I'm downsizing to a one bedroom. Um, so I sold one air conditioner. I'm in the process of selling it to somebody and I already got like part of the money for it. So that helps with the move in stuff. Um, and then my acid reflux pillow. I don't always use this, but it's really good. I can't sleep with this thing. Like you're supposed to be able to sleep when you get, when you have acid reflux, it props you up, but I can't sleep with that thing. It's just, I'm so used to lying down flat. So, and this is Luna's cat tree. So I don't know if I'm taking both cat trees. I might have to part with one, but if, I can like find a place to put two of them, like one in the living room, one in the bedroom, like I have right here, then it's fine. But if not, I'm going to donate one. Um, they both came from PetSmart. So, or Petco, I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah, you don't want to see my little mess here with my Gatorades and all that. Um, but I do have my nightstand pretty much cleared out. Actually, actually I don't, Never mind. Um, I need to take this stuff out. Um, this is a box of candles and honestly I do not like candles because I would rather have like a flameless candle that runs on batteries because I'm so nervous with candles like fire like I'm just worried about it I'm really cautious this is my um blood pressure monitor I guess that I'll take in these batteries but yeah and this is my personal drawer which I'm not gonna show because it has my personal items in there um, but yeah, pretty much I've kind of gone a long way. So yeah, I'm very excited for this move. My bed, I'm still taking my bed, of course. My full-size bed. I love this headboard. I love this bed. Like, it came in a box and I just love it. So, yeah, I just wanted to give y'all an update. So I will be doing a part three to moving uh, next Tuesday if I have time to shoot a video. If not, then it will be next it'll be Wednesday or Sunday that I'll post because I want to do like my apartment set up and then do a video. Um, I do have the video for um, the empty apartment tour thing. Um, I may do that, but I already have footage of it and we'll see if I feel like doing that, but I may just do an apartment video that I have all my things in there. And I don't really know if I'm taking, um, this with me. I might take it to put in my bathroom so I can get those, um, collapsible storage things so I can put stuff in my bathroom because... Like I said, my bathroom is not going to be that big, but what I love my bathroom, because I've already toured the unit. My bathroom is going to be in my bedroom. And right now my bathroom is not in my bedroom. If y'all seen my video before, my vanity is right here. And then my bathroom is in here. So yeah, it's my bathroom. <laughs> yeah, I use a shower chair because I get dizzy sometimes and it's better than falling in the shower. But um, 
yeah it's all coming together it's still my apartment is very much in shambles but it is getting there my kitchen is in shambles so i'm getting rid of my microwave because it's disgusting it's starting to rust and i'm just i don't want a microwave i usually like to use my oven and my stove top if i need to heat something up um, so yeah, I'm getting rid of the microwave. I don't need it. I don't want it. I don't like to use microwaves anymore because I feel like it doesn't make my food as good or healthy. I know some of you may have conflicting views about that, but, um, yeah, I made some dinner earlier or not dinner, um, lunch. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, everything's kind of in shambles. It's kind of embarrassing because it's messy, but like I gotta, I'm probably going to take these shelves with me just because I can also use that in my bathroom. And the black shelving thing that I just showed, I will probably put that in my bedroom, even though I have a nightstand. So yeah, it's all coming together. Um, my TV hopefully will fit in this box. I measured it and I don't know if it's going to. I got this from the dumpster, um, the side of the dumpster where my apartments are. So like that I live in right now, but I measured it and it's only gonna be 58 inches. So I don't know if this TV is gonna fit. Because my TV is like 65, so <laughs> I may have to get a different, um, like a moving box from U-Haul or like 20 something dollars or if I want to go Lowe's and pay, pay like 40 bucks because I may not, I may not want to spend 20, 40 dollars, but I don't, I want to preserve my TV. I will get so upset. And angry because this TV costs almost $700 and I'm just like this is my only TV now because I got rid of my other one because I don't like to have TVs in my bedroom but I might have to put this in my bedroom because my living room is gonna need to be smaller so and then I got my sound system um, don't know what box I'm gonna put it in because it already came in an odd box when me and my ex bought it so I am taking it with me I tried to sell it but nobody wanted it nobody wants a file cabinet nobody wants the glass desk so i'm just like well i guess i'm donating it or leaving it behind um i'm gonna be getting a new entertainment center so i've been looking and i found one on walmart that is kind of like this but in the middle it's got a fireplace because i want that extra heating in my apartment because my apartment's only gonna have they don't have baseboard heating yet because they're trying to get an appraisal to like add more features to the building um and i'm gonna be on the third floor so out of five which is crazy because in Oregon, that's not really common. I mean, some places are, but not really around here. So I'm probably going to end up donating this because I don't think it's going to fit in my bedroom. So we'll see. But I'm really excited to get like a fireplace thing in the center. And then I can put like my Xbox on the side somewhere. So I'm excited about that. And then yeah that's the other cat tree so yeah i think that's about it for right now i will update you guys either tuesday or tuesday to sunday because i'm going to be busy moving on tuesday and signing my lease so yeah i just want to give you all an update um hopefully see you in the next vlog bye